Welcome to the Joy of Development. This is episode 5 of our VR snowboarding project. Today we're going to be finishing up our character's code and giving them the ability to do spin tricks. For this, we're going to need a custom event. So right click, search custom event, and give it a name. I called mine Spin. This event will be triggered upon leaving the ground to set a rotation rate for our character. The first thing we'll do here is if spin set is set to false, we'll set it to true and execute the event. Now we'll get a snapshot of our rotation from hand yaw, and then we'll delay for a brief moment. This delay is actually why we need to make this an event rather than a function, because delays can't be placed inside of functions. From there we're going to get the rotation delta from our previous yaw to our current yaw. We'll use this for the result of our spin rate, and we'll use a multiplier to adjust it as needed. I usually take off about an order of magnitude, but as always, play around with this. Just don't go too fast or you might get VR sickness. Now that our spin event's all set, let's jump into our air controls and finish things up there. In here, we're going to be finishing up those last two tasks at the bottom. For the first one, we're going to check if spin set is true. If it's false, we're going to execute that spin event we just made. But if it's true, we're going to add our rotation rate to our actor's local rotation. After that, we're going to add a little bit of friction to our spin to slow it down over time. So if our spin rate's in the negative direction, we're going to slowly add to the spin rate. And if we're spinning in the positive direction, we'll slowly subtract from it. For that, I just used a select node to choose the appropriate result. Now let's preview the game and see the final version of our character's code in action. We'll make our way down to the test jump, and in the next episode, I'll show you guys how to sculpt and texture terrain of your own. Now we're approaching the jump. After we lift off, we're going to rapidly rotate our snowboard to generate our spin. And that's a successful 720. If you like the channel, don't forget to subscribe, ring the bell icon, and smash that like button.